mark. Ah, <laughs> Every time. Does this look like a midlife crisis to you? No. He looks cool. He looks cool. I'd say that looks yeah. cool. Do you think he looks cool? What about this? That, no, that's another cool guy. A couple of cool dudes. I keep getting flashbacks. Just being stabbed, hung, freaking out, crying. Small moments of happiness. That's what you want from work. <laughs> Very small moments of happiness. Uh, they're Mormons. Yeah. Can Mormons swear? All humans can swear. <laughs> but I wasn't nervous, like Tyker. Bit bored, confident. <laughs> <laughs> I just love working with Reese. We're good together. You know, nothing's going to tear us apart. Us against the world, man. Yeah, it's it, always been like that. How would you describe a pirate in three words? I'm going to do four, because four is harder. Stubborn. Against the grain. Because they are fighting against society. They're against the man. Okay, you know. yeah, well, now you're up to like 24 words. I felt like you didn't understand. Four words were <laughs> clear enough. You're looking at me like, oh, yeah. I did a coast to coast once, um, which was from one coast to another coast. You gotta take. That's in, what coast in, to coast means. In mind, New Zealand is pretty thin, so it's not. Yeah. You know, we're not talking. <laughs> it's yeah. It's about one end of the beach. It's an hour to get to the other end, but he was. No, out there. I, I. It was a whole week in the wilderness. It's only it meant to like be a day. War, it was... But he got lost. Yeah. <laughs> no. Nah. Carry on. Okay. Well, it's life, isn't it? Life is a. Life is that sort of subtle balance of comedy and drama, don't you agree, Sam? I find yeah. there's nothing worse. Light than... and shadow. Light sorry. and sh shade. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, excuse me. <laughs> so Sam and I are talking now, Reese. I'm back. Um, I find there's nothing worse than when I'm you're watching. Excuse me. Okay, sorry. Go. I was just going to. When you're watching. Quiet! A... Listen! <laughs> but in every scene that we do. Just, just like this. <laughs> it's magic. This bit didn't make it in. And when you're trying to edit something out magic of that, you, you guys get your cracking arms around me and take me and squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. squeeze and this is what you had to deal with every day. Up and you're having to deal with it now. Yeah. Well, yeah. the eye patch thing and the pig leg. That did not happen, okay? There was the odd chap that may have lost an eye, but you wouldn't really have patched it, because if you can't see out of one eye, that's just life. It's the other way around. There were many eye pegs. Because if you lost yeah. it in a knife, like, yeah. and yeah, it's so gone, and then they'll shove a peg in. Yeah. Plug it up. It would be a knee patch. And of course, with the eye peg, which did stick out, that's where people got the idea of, oh, he's using a telescope. Oh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's just some of the funny crack up things that me and Reese get up to when we're hanging out. You and Tyga have been collaborating from what I can see for at least, you know, the better part of the last two decades, but why this project and why now? Well, I was brought on board and, uh, you know, <laughs> <laughs> I got the job. He was hired. He didn't have any choice. <laughs> Uh, I was forced to do it once they said we want you. <laughs> there should always be something that, that uh, tickles your ginny, you know? Yeah. I'm completely unsure of what that you know means. You know that, I'm saying, tickle, <laughs> tickle your ginny. You didn't win in 2005, and your fellow nominees left you hanging on the prank. But you did win an Oscar in 2020. Would you say you had the last laugh after all? <laughs> I didn't write that. <laughs> yeah, I'm right. I know. You guys have uh, worked together uh, quite a bit. Uh, Taika, does Reese take orders well when you're directing him? He's nodding. Why are you nodding? Because <laughs> <He's laughs> I do take orders, orders well. The question's for me. Ah. Oh. You'll get yours in a minute, Reese. I'll, I'll ask what he's like as a director. <laughs> we'll get to that. <laughs> and uh, I want to make sure I fit in with what Tyker's vision is. And so he'll certainly let me know if I am or not. And uh, hopefully I, di I did an OK job again. Yeah, you're, you're still in it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be the new Thor. He's not, oh, by the way, none of these people are in it. Oh. Nah, I'm not rehiring really anyone I've ever worked with before. It's great. I've stepped up to big time now. <laughs> you now I'm big time all these people. I could be no the new Thor. It. If <laughs> you could choose any role or responsibility within the pirate ship, what would you pick? And which one would you do? Anything. There's another thing. Look how long the question is. <laughs> I know. You want to go wrap it? They're three-pronged questions. It's the sort of thing you'd write an essay on. Well, you're getting an essay, like it or not. We actually got to work as actors together, because normally yeah. he's behind the camera yelling at me. Um, and so, yeah, that was really fun, because, you know, we we, we, we have the same sense of humour, and we, we like to joke around a lot, and now we've got an excuse to do it on, on, on screen. We know how each other kind of 
uh, yeah, uh, our sensibilities and like yeah, as Reese was saying, we're very similar style as well. And we and when it comes to the banter stuff and yeah, and also the fun stuff where we do a lot of improvising together, yeah, that is like a really fun safe space for us where it's like we kind of just feel like younger versions of ourselves. Just feel like yeah, we're just just mates hanging out again and just um, just jamming. I didn't want those um, scenes to end really. Uh, what's Blackbeard's real name? Edward Teach. Yes. Yours are really basic. Because they know I don't know anything about them. <laughs> you could finish each other's sentences. This is. Nearly. So close. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I love improvising. Sentences. I, <laughs> <laughs> I love sentences. <laughs> but I prefer paragraphs. Did you actually watch my show? Yes. I watched your show three times. Oh, wow. That is true. <laughs> do you, There's nothing do, else to do. <laughs> it says here, do you remember what it was? <laughs> the show? <laughs> well, like most comedy shows, it was a list of jokes yeah. and you said them. It's actually really, um, it takes a long time to get the balance of the comedy and the, and the pathos. Uh, and that's the editing. I it took a long it time. It takes a long time to tickle the Jenny. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's actually that's relatively quick. I, I want to ask Julian something real quick. If you got your Jenny out. <laughs> Julian! Let's tickle the Jenny! Say something! Anything I would do to avoid anything to do with cleaning. Yeah, well, you'll be right up in the crow's nest. Yeah, I'll be like, I can't clean yeah. that. We're cleaning now! I'm up here. I looked the wrong way. I was like, I'm cleaning now? Yeah, you. Yeah. What? But might be another one above you. Oh, another one above you. Yeah. What's he saying? Have you seen I... anything up there? I can't see anything from here. I'm two levels up. You're closer, bro. But also, I'd do more. Yeah, you're not, it's not, not just, just that. More. There's it's more. That's not all I do in my life. Exactly. What would be your pirate weapon of choice? Definitely wit. Yeah, so we get into sharp, a fight. Razor sharp wit. And then straight in with some cutting wit. That kind of thing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Now you get them. Right there, I was like, oh my god, he's teasing me. Good choice. Okay. How hey, there's Tyka. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, is he just, Tyka's fast, just walking along? Doing the old fake phone call. Yeah, fake phone, phone call. Hey? Reese's. Tyka. Hey, everyone's Tyka. Reese is renting out his house on. Uh, oh, 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 no! Get out of town! He's Are you going to rent it? Fuck, it's too expensive. Oh, I know. Yes. Yeah, we haven't had any. <laughs> haven't anyone keen. Do you think you influence me? I think I inspire you. Truth. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what an ass. Oh my uh, god. Okay. I don't think that really <laughs> <That's laughs> right, You don't fine. care what I you know about my opinion. <laughs> yeah. Or that you know look at like wake up and go, what would Tiger do? <laughs> okay. I felt a bit lonely and that, <laughs> and that angered me. Oh, I spoke I spoke to you, bro. Yeah. Yeah, you did. I mean, you, well, yeah, you, you're my only friend. Wooden peg or hook as a hand? I have wooden legs. Two wooden legs. Two. I'd be completely made of wood, just right. up to here. How long are your legs? The legs are about five times longer than a normal. Oh, so you're huge. Tall as the stage here. Boom. I'd be similar, but my wooden body would be retractable. I'd spend half an hour figuring out which way it folds. Oh, yeah, God. You know, and I'd get it wrong, and I'd end up like this kind of thing. Done it oh, again. That, that'll do for tonight. Yeah, someone have to come and untangle yeah. you in the morning. All right. Well, we've done that. Thanks. Would you say that as an actor, you have leading man looks? <laughs> I don't know. You tell me. I think so. I agree. That's a yes. And then snuck out in the middle of the night, left his wife and the kids. Real hero. <laughs> <laughs> now we get our treats. You said there's going to be treats if we do this. Some lollies. Yeah, there's a lot of actors in the, in, that we were working with on this, but it was always the most exciting for me to, when it was me and just me and Ruth, because because we've got such an old you know, friendship and you know we and, and we love playing and we just keep going. No, 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 you're not cutting. We're doing it again. <laughs> yeah, mainly and, no one and, tells and, us what a, to do. As a producer, <laughs> I can say no, 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 no. We're going to keep going because <laughs> I'm having fun with this now. Reese Darby is in my opinion and the one of the greatest improvisers i've ever known and i've been in the scenes i've been in the trenches with him to prove it awesome that's me you are telling the truth oh thank god when it comes to my friends i always tell the truth uh, oh man <laughs> <laughs> guys this kid is face, going no. somewhere yeah. <laughs> Re Reese on that look sam told oh okay <clears throat> that's one of mine I... Oh, this is ridiculous. Would you rather have a wooden peg or a hook? I mean, who wrote these? This is the bottom of the barrel kind of question. Yeah, they've got to the end or of the a tether. Hook. I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> well, if he's not doing it, I'm going home too. I'm going home. You can. I'll do it at home.
What do you think about my looks? I think you're dashing. I think you're a very good looking man. No. Yes. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. This is nerve wracking for the questionnaire. And try to figure out why he left his family. Obviously. And um, try to, um, you know, see why he had this relationship with Blackbeard. Um, so. Many debate the location and year of Blackbeard's birth. What are your theories? You know all my, my theories. My biceps are natural, but they're actually quite big. <laughs> <laughs> On what island was the battle that Blackbeard and his men got ambushed? Um, Karampagolo. That might be how you pronounce it. Here it says Ocracoke Island. <laughs> <laughs> A score of 86, so total sleep was 8 hours 43 minutes. Oh, wow, that's a good but score. But my REM was suffering, and yeah, only an hour of REM. I was trying to show oh, you my goodness. sleep. Good. Where's my, um, oh, there you go, 8.54. That's great, Reese. you That's pretty great. good for me. Good. Yeah. Right. I don't want to, but yes, I'm ready. All right, we'll go with maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Believe in this yourself. This isn't awkward at all. <laughs> <laughs> it's 20 years ago. I know, don't remind me. How dare you? It's 20 years ago, and you're going to try and get between us, drive a wedge between us and our friendship. I think if I remember his show, or if I went to see his show 20 years ago, God damn, I did. Have you seen my recent special, Mystic Time Bird? No. Okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> and it was fucking magical to do that naked... Well, not naked, but like... <laughs> being emotionally naked together. Yeah. Did that lead to any kind of, uh, like, happy accidents along the way? <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Well, with something we'd like to announce. <laughs> <laughs> Taika, Reese, we've brought you here today to take a lie detector test. Oh. Ah, really? I thought this was going to be another award. Yet, an, <laughs> yet another award for me. I was hoping for a, a award. An award? It's an award. Oh, sorry. Fair to say you're obsessed with supernatural creatures. Um, I don't know about supernatural. Yeah, uh, it's a, that's the wording is not quite right. Yeah, there. because I would say the abom abomin abominable, abominable, the yeti <laughs> um, is not supernatural. No. Any cryptozoological experiences <laughs> with monsters or paranormal? This is made up, another made-up word, Reese. No, no. <laughs> that's what the show's about. Oh, it's called cryptozoology. Do you think that you're influential? Influential? That's not the word. It's, that's the word. That is the word. <laughs> Do you truly believe in things like yetis and chupacab? Cabra, chupacabra. Chupacabra. El Chupacabra. The goat sucker. Yes. I've Variant solved. I've met a few goat suckers in my time. <laughs> the chup Chupacabra, for example. Chewbacca. <laughs> no, the Chupacabra. Do you think Chewbacca's real? Do you think Chewbacca is real? Well, no. He's, he's a fictional character, but he's based on the Sasquatch, which is real. He's telling the truth. The Sasquatch is real cool. Yep. You okay, found that out today. That. Yeah, we've been connected for a long time. And then when we, you know, got involved over here in America with things, we've always felt, yeah, like kindred spirits, really, I guess. Yeah. And, and kind of we always supported each other, had each other's back and always not really believed that we should be here. Yeah. And our bond and the way that we, you know, connect and work together. Like we often like we just... I know there's like a look between us when they were on set and like there'll be a look between me and Reese where we just both like go. And it's like, can be like, <laughs> what are we doing here? And also, can you believe that we're here? Like yeah. where we yeah. come from? And it's like, it's always great that we both like pinch ourselves. And so, and I, I, I really love that um, our working relationship. So I want it to keep going. Yeah. You said you didn't do any research to play Blackbeard in Our Flag Means Death. Do you think maybe you should have? <laughs> no. No. I'm celebrated for that role. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm celebrated for that role. So it's just proof word. you don't need to do any research. I took sailing lessons to prepare for my part. Do you think that was an overkill? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, obviously I'm a bit of a sailor anyway. Me too, coming from New Zealand. I'm on boats all the time. <laughs> You, Brett and Jermaine would sometimes laugh so much that you had to shoot your coverage separately. 
Yes. That's true. Do I ever make you laugh that hard? Yes. Truth. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. Lucky son of a gun. <laughs> and so it was scary, but having Taika there made it uh, easier for me to do because mm. uh, we're in this together. And uh, I think if he wasn't there, I'd probably be trying to track him down and call him to help me because yeah, it's, it's a scary prospect, but. Um, and so we kind of discovered and sort of drilled and what was our friendship? Where did it come from and how did it, and how do we relate yeah. to each other in this crazy world? And so we turned that realness into the, into the fictional side of things and, and um, you know, created something pretty good, I think. Describe Steve's relationship with Blackbeard in three words. Up and down. Describe Blackbeard's relationship with Steed in three words. Ooh, down and up. Well done. We did it. We finished. You know, might we see other reunions between you two for other projects? We're, we're going to work together forever. I know that. 